Let's have a look at why BDCom, right? Um, for the past 20 years, BDCom has excelled in their innovative or rather innovation to become um, one of the top leaders in networking and communication solutions. Now, BDCom is best known for their excellent track record in reliability and performance, which of course enabling them to be um, a lot more cost effective for both network and fiber connectivity, whether it be to homes or businesses. Um, and they've actually spread all the way through in Africa. Now, this in turn means that you are now able to procure BDCOM from Miro, the sole distributor for BDCOM. Um, and this again, then in turn, will enable you to deliver world-class connectivity to your customers. Now, for the last four years, um, Miro and BDCOM have partnered to connect communities uh, in through their diversified portfolio and have expanded past fiber, uh, which is their other side of BDCOM, into core networking and PoE networking switches. Now, BDCOM switches um, and Xbon products, routers, and, and networking security devices have been widely applied in many areas, such as banking systems, um, education departments, governments, and even the defense system in China, now, which stimulates the um, leapfrog type of development in an era of information technology. So today, BDCOM isn't the new kid on the block, nor have they been in the neighborhood for long, but they've made quite um, a name for themselves uh, in the last couple of years. There's also a case study available on our mirror website that you can have a look at with regards to um, a fiber network, which we will talk about a bit later after this webinar, but just also know that, that BDCOM does have a fiber application. Now, as I've mentioned, for over 20 years, BDCOM has been providing solutions uh, with network components all over the world. They've gone for bits against some of the biggest names in ICT, and they've actually won. Now, BDCOM has also got a diverse product line offerings. Um, apart from, as I've mentioned previously, the Xpon, they have a full range of 10 gig fiber switches, 10, 100 and gigabit PoE switches, and then of course, Soho routers. Much of their budget um, gets put into R&D, which allows them to stay completely ahead or competitively ahead of their components by focusing on market trends um, and then, of course, on the customer. BDCOM is also a proud um, vendor that offers support in over 32 service centers uh, that is, of course, located around the world so that they can stay connected with their customers. And also being an OEM manufacturer allows for some space when it comes to innovation. So if they find that there's a need for a a uh, particular hardware device, they will build it because they can. So BDCOM can eliminate the digital communication barrier um, with the innovative products. Like I said, they, they're quite um, yeah, keen on new type of technology and how to implement it into either new product range or um, updating an existing one. They also have a very low RMA return rate, meaning that the manufacturer is reliable. Once the hardware is up, it stays up. This is why we introduced the BDCOM's lifetime warranty features on all of their switches. Offering customizable solutions and open access hardware allows for the manufacturer to appeal to more customers because the devices will openly integrate with existing solutions and networks. Let's have a look at some of the features of the BDCOM switches. Now, Managed and unmanaged switches have uplink smart PoE ports with a large buffer memory introduced by BDCOM. It is designed for wireless coverage in small, medium, I'd say to larger networks. Um, we will go through the switches further in the presentation where hopefully we can identify some that will meet your network requirements. Um, if we have a look at the BDCOM S1200 series, for instance, uh, that series has got three models, uh, an 8-port, a 16-port, and a 24-port, which, of course, meets the need of networks on different scales. 
Um, then we've got the NMS, the software management platform. We will again look at some of the features a little bit later in this presentation. Um, those features will also include the benefits and it will be a bit more extensive, um, extensively explained in the presentation. But it is important to note the benefits of having a free software platform um, from where you can manage and monitor your network. I'll also introduce you to the online videos that are available explaining the NMS um, management platform in detail. Okay, high uh, PoE budgets. Now, a good PoE switch offers high speed networking um, or a network connection and power supply to one power device through one single port. That's the reason for that. So this, of course, reduces the need for extra outlets and extension cables and it saves deployment costs and labor efforts as well. And then of course, exclusive to Miro, we offer again, as I've mentioned, the lifetime guarantees on all the BDCOM switches. So let's have a look at some of the BDCOM switch features. Um, if I can mention a series, uh, the S2 900s, for instance, it features BDROS um, a platform. Okay, so the BDROS is a software platform um, which BDCOM owns independently. It's their intellectual property. So it supports functions such as powerful ACL, flexible Q and key, um, VLAN switching, Ethernet OEM, um, the operations administration and maintenance, uh, which basically means fault management and performance management capabilities that are incorporated in support of Ethernet services. Um, carrier level QoS and industry level 10 gig ether ring, which in turn ensures the switch series meets the application requirements in all kinds of complicated sites. It also supports layer three routing protocol. Um, but just to get back to what exactly it means to have an industrial ethernet ring um, and what it supports, it supports industry level EAPS, um, and their protection shift time is less than 50 milliseconds. And with their high reliability, um, it's represented by the null packet loss, which has been provided or proved rather by many years of applications in the grid. Um, things like the defense systems, um, transportation. But let's have a look at some of the switches that are available from Miro. Right, we'll start off with the smaller unmanaged switches. Uh, these switches are generally used in small to medium sized enterprises or networks. Um, they are generally used for applications such as video surveillance and Wi-Fi access, etc. We will be referring to base T ports. Um, and just as a quick reminder, the base refers to the base hand signaling. Um, which means that only Ethernet signals are carried on this medium and the T represents the twisted pair. Right, so we've got the six port um, right there at the top, which is a six port PoE switch designed for video surveillance um, and Wi-Fi access as mentioned above. This also has four 100 uh, M PoE ports and two 100 M base T ports with a switching capacity of 1.2 gigabits per second. The BDCOM PS101, um, the one at the bottom there you'll see is a 10 port PoE switch. It features eight 100 PoE ports and two 100 base T ports with a switching capacity of two gigabits per second. Now the BDCOM 18 port, um, you'll see that this guy has got 18 port um, PoE, or it is an 18 port PoE switch, which features 16 100 M PoEs and two gigabit combo ports with a switching capacity of 7.2 gigabits per second. Now the 26 port unit has a PoE budget of 370 watt, the one at the bottom. Uh, it features 24 10 100 RJ45 ports, also comes with two combo ports collectively providing two gigabits per second. Now, these are also SFP ports, which in turn means that you now have a data communication application through fiber optic, or then of course a copper network cable with a switching capacity of 8.8 .8 gigabits per second. 
Now, the following switches are gigabit switches with a much higher switching uh, capacity. Now, these switches remain in the small, medium size type of uh, applications, right? The BDCOM PS1501, the one at the top, um, this unit is a 10 port gigabit PoE switch. The switch also features 8 gigabit PoE ports and 2 gigabit base T ports. Its switching capacity is 20 gigabits per second. The one at the bottom, the switch features 14 gigabit PoE ports and 2 gigabit SFP ports. Its switching capacity is 36 gigabits per second. Now, with the 18 port, um, let me just do that, featuring 16 gigabit PoE ports and 2 gigabit SFP ports. Let's have a look at some of the managed switches. Um, right at the top, you can see I spoke about the S series a little bit earlier. Now, this guy is the S2510P. It's an 8 port gigabit PoE switch featuring high reliability layer 3 routing functions. Now, this switch has 8 gigabit PoE ports and is easy to manage and maintain. It also supports manual and dynamic PoE power allocation, and the PoE plus power is maintained during a switch reload. Then we've got the 18 port right at the bottom, uh, the PS221. Uh, this switch is designed for enterprise networks. Uh, it features carrier level high reliability layer three routing functions and supports a maximum of 16 uh, 100 uh, PoE ports and two gigabit TX SFP combo uplink ports. Based on the new generation high performance hardware and BDROS uh, platform, it also supports functions such as ACL, QNQ, and QoAs. Right, the BDCOM 24 port switch is an ideal solution for any scenario. Uh, if you think about applications such as IP phones or surveillance systems, uh, Wi Fi access points, all of these that need to be connected, this is the perfect switch for you. It has um, 24 ports on 100 uh, PoE ports. And then of course you have two, um, two ports, combo ports that will collectively give you uh, two gigabits per second. Now the fiber switches. Um, sure, these switches support priority retagging and complicated flow classifications based on VLAN, source address, uh, destination address, IP, or priority to better streamline carrier services. Now, it also supports and provides flexible bandwidth control policies and supports port flow-based flow limit and ensuring the line speed forwarding of each port to make sure the high quality of, let's say, for instance, video streaming or audio um, you know, other data related services. It also supports versatile IPv6 solutions. Um, it's flexible and convenient management and uh, maintenance by the NMS system. And as mentioned earlier, industrial ethernet ring with zero delay and zero packet loss, which of course makes it the, the perfect security mechanism. Uh, there's a lot more on these switches, all of which is covered extensively in the video I'm going to share with you in a bit. Um, but before I do, let's do a quick introduction to BDCOM's NMS. Now, I think we can all agree that there is a definite business trend um, and a necessity almost to have your network run from a software-based type of network management system. The best part is if it's a free management system, that's obviously a win-win. Uh, there are numerous benefits as far as monitoring tools go for service providers, which includes things like um, controlled costs, increased efficiency, uh, reducing downtime, and of course it increases your flexibility. So if you think about having a system where you can effectively um, remotely manage your networks, that will reduce the cost, um, especially if you have to send out um, a technician to site, as you can see, that first point shows that plus minus 70% um, of manpower is the single biggest expense of for most uh, companies. Um, and monitoring software also reduces the time it takes to solve major network problems. Um, again, you don't need to send someone out to do the diagnostics. 
Now, BDCOM NMS, um, it supports SNMP, which of course your, means your smart network management platform, uh, to realize automatic equipment discovery, network topology management, uh, equipment configuration management, performance data statistics, and analysis and trouble management. As you can see on the slide, uh, the BDCOM NMS also provides you with email alerts um, and support for both Linux and Windows operating systems. Uh, the network management and some of more of the feature sets, uh, the network management often provides a means for security. Uh, things like access control, system upgrades, and even policy enforcement. Um, I think we can all agree that data is too important to lose through poor network management. Now, more advantages of BDCOM's network management includes uh, the ability to monitor every piece of hardware as well as the software. Um, you'll see the first point, for instance, read remote ONU configuration. Again, the same platform is used for BDCOM's fiber portfolio, um, but you can also do things like firmware upgrades on the switches, device performance and usage graphs, um, network topology, error and event logging, and as I've mentioned, even email alerts and alarms. With the customization, now, for all of us that are in business, I think versatility and customization go hand in hand. Um, it also, it goes hand in hand in, in producing a, a network management system for you across the board, uh, those two components. Not all networks operate the same, um, and the criteria for clients connected are not the same. BDCOM NMS provide you with the interface that you can reshape um, to best fit your needs. And of course, it includes things like device presets, um, alert levels, user accounts, event and change logs, and device performance statistics. Right, as you can see here, um, this is literally to show you where some of the switches can fit in with regards to what is available for which application. BDCOM switch portfolio covers core switches, aggregation switches, and of course, access switches, and provides customers with end-to-end -end integrated network solutions. Again, just as a friendly reminder, please connect with us, especially our technical team, where we can assist you with networking solution, um, and then, of course, placement of BDCOM switches, and of course, if you are looking for fiber on their fiber side as well. Some of the applications that we've seen BDCOM being deployed in is smart cities, transportation, data centers, power grid, government applications, financial institutions, the biggest one, of course, wireless ISPs, um, and even all the way through to education and medical. So in conclusion, um, you only have a one-time hardware cost. There's no software or management fees. Incredibly easy to install and set up your network via the NMS system. You have 24-7 online assistance from BDCOM themselves. Um, they will easily log into your network. They will do the troubleshooting and assist you um, in whichever way is needed. They also provide free training, which you can do through Miro, which I'm going to talk about in a minute. Um, it is also cost disruptive in the market. They've come in playing against uh, the big players standing chest to chest, and they've accomplished a lot. Um, we've also got stock readily available. As I've mentioned previously, Miro is a stock holding distributor, which means that we have um, stock readily available. But of course, that has been legalized as well. Um, and then, of course, best part of it all, it comes with lifetime guarantees. Um, not a lot of vendors can say that with their switches. Right. Um, the BDCOM video that I am referring to in this slide, uh, this video will show you in detail how to set up your network via the BDCOM switches and utilizing the NMS um, software or the management platform, um, all the way through from how to adopt devices, uh, set up alerts and user accounts, um, all the way through to you effectively managing and monitoring your network 
remotely. Uh, on Miro's website, that is the top uh, one. That will show you exactly on the video. It's on the brand page of our website. Alternatively, you can view that video on YouTube with that link. 